man, like, we just tricked, my nigga. We, we just tricked. It's like, like I say, we over here for the bread. It's opportunity over here. We tough. We the, guy, we the bullies of the world. We fucking up and taking shit and doing all kind of fucking with people for no reason and, you know, all kind of shit because we just tough like that. You know what I'm saying? Like, a lot of the shit, we the bad guys. You know what I'm saying? So, understand that. I'm almost done with my joint. I done got too high and gave y'all a whole spill. I'm erasing this shit. Fuck y'all. I ain't putting this shit on the internet. You niggas be having nigga on YouTube. I be on here high, just chopping it up and shit. You know what I'm saying? Y'all niggas take a line out this whole heavy sounded crazy, man. One line. I had to take one little line out. Fuck America, dude. Slim says, fuck America. <laughs> fuck y'all, man. Y'all motherfuckers. Yeah, there's opportunity out here. You get a bankroll out here. So, everybody else coming over here to get the bread, you better get you some. And niggas over, niggas from out of, out of the country talk down on us, too. You just know that. Like, them African niggas be looking at us like we sorry and lazy than a bitch. They be like, because they come over here and bring, just imagine how many motherfuckers, the valet, everybody from overseas came over here, bought some shit, chop, making bread. You know what I'm saying? Like, they don't look at us like no hustlers. They look at us like, them niggas be bullshitting over there, man. Them niggas just lazy and shit. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, but uh, everywhere got a hood. Everywhere got a, uh, you know, a, a, a top level place. You know what I'm saying? End of the day, who the fuck is you and where you at? Like, don't tell me about the shit that's going on in the hood. That's just like if you live in Chicago. You know what I'm saying? Like, when I go out there, I'll be like, damn, you know, just hearing so much about Chicago, it make you think that, you're going to get your head blown off any way you go. And that's not what's up. You know, the shit go down in the hood. But what the fuck is you over there for anyway? You don't belong over there. Everywhere got a hood where you're not supposed to be. You know what I'm saying? So you can't judge shit off of the hood all the time. Because that's just that one area. You know what I'm saying? So that's what you got to understand. Go see some shit. And then you can really see some shit. God damn, there's some bitches at the park. Hey, everywhere. Yeah. Right. So. Right. I say mostly immigrants on cabs, counter stoves, beauty stores, nail salons, everything. They look at us like we lazy as fuck. How the fuck is Asians? selling all of the uh, products for black hair. How the fuck is Asians selling all of the products for black people hair? How many black people are selling Asians hair products? Zero. Think about that. Think about that. It's for real. It's crazy than a motherfucker. It's crazy. What the fuck is you doing on my live? Yeah. Think about that for a second. So are we lazy? How do how many Asians, how many uh foreigners, period, just you know, own the counter stores like my boy said, in the hoods? Nobody go to do nothing else but in the hoods, they own all the shit in the hood. We don't own shit in their hood. You go to uh, uh, Chinatown, what do black people own? Nothing. You know what I'm saying? Nothing. So are we bullshitting? Are we lazy? What the fuck? Like, yeah, hell yeah we is. Hell yeah we is. And that's what it is. And niggas come around here and say they broke. But it's so much opportunity, motherfuckers who coming from overseas, barely even know how to speak English, is taken advantage of. You know what I'm saying? These motherfuckers, you born here. They come from another country, barely even knowing how to talk and say shit to you. 
but still selling your shit. You know what I'm saying? Like, step your game up, man. Like, you know what I'm saying? Straight like that. Ain't no excuses, you know, pretty much. Because if they can do the shit in your neighborhood, <laughs> in a neighborhood you familiar with, they come over in your neighborhood and shutting down the shop.